Mr. Speaker, members, we're very close to resolving some important issues with the Senate on multiple issues we're trying to close the special session out with. Um, so for that reason, I'd like to postpone Senate Bill 1 till 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mr. Schaefer, for what purpose? Mr. Schaefer, for what purpose? Yes, sir. Uh, will the gentleman yield for some questions? Representative Bonner, do you yield for questions? Glad to yield for questions. Mr. Mr. Bonin, can I ask you what uh, what would change about our action on the floor tonight, based on what's happening in the Senate? Don't it's we want? About, it's not. I didn't say it's based on what's happening in the Senate. It's based on negotiations that are going on between the House and the Senate to resolve a multitude of issues that are of great significance to the people of Texas in both of these chambers, so that we can have success on many issues for Texas. Well, Chairman Bonin, if we were to vote this bill out on third reading, uh, the bill is different than the bill as it left the Senate. And so I think we all contemplate a conference committee where those kind of discussions take place in a conference committee. So why would we we're do not, anything? I'm not saying we aren't having conversations, that we wouldn't have conversations in conference right, so, so what I'm telling you is that you understand well when we get to the end of sessions lots of issues are in play multiple bills multiple issues and i'm trying to ensure that we make this work for both bodies i've spoken with the lieutenant governor today i've just spoke with his chief of staff and they're abundantly aware of the fact that i'm asking to postpone this bill because we're having great conversations to send all the members home with positive success for the state of texas and, and chairman bottom my point is uh, can't we walk and chew gum at the same time why not put this bill one step closer because that would, in the process because that finish, would, let me because it the would let me I know the question, question because it would jeopardize the negotiations on multiple important issues that we are trying on to what bring. bills what, what, what what's it going to jeopardize bills, Mr. Schaefer well, why don't you be specific for the body and let's be out out front and transparent there are several bills and if you think for a second you can figure them out Chairman Bonin I know that this bill is before the body now and I, as and the author of the bill, have requested the chamber to allow me to postpone my bill till 8 a.m. tomorrow. So, Chairman Bonin, there's no reason why negotiations cannot continue. There is a reason this, why, because once this bill leaves this please? body, we do not have the ability to continue those discussions. Chairman Bonin, can I, can I ask a sure. question without you interrupting? Go ahead, ask your question. Since we can vote this bill out on third reading tonight... And should the Senate act as it would in this type of situation and move to appoint a conference committee? They could also accept the bill, though. Couldn't all those negotiations continue while all that's happening? And we can demonstrate well, to the people the of Texas that we are working and moving forward rather than delaying. We're not delaying, Mr. Schaefer. The reality of it is by not, by moving. The board this, says Mr. motion Schaefer, to postpone. By, it does say that, Mr. Schaefer. It does say that. And you know, we used to honor members in this body that when a member came up here on a bill that they have authored and request the support of their colleagues to postpone their own bill so that they can do something for the greater good of the entire body and the work with the Senate. The Senate understands the motion I am making. I just hung up off the phone with the Chief of Staff, Lieutenant Governor, to reassure him and let him know that we are making great progress, which he agrees with, and I don't want to jeopardize that. I'd like Bonin, to solve these problems. This bill doesn't and I'm belong sorry to that you. Don't agree the gentleman's with that. time has expired. J Chairman Bonham, this bill doesn't belong to Mr. you. Shaver, it belongs the, to the people of Texas. Mr. Shaver, the gentleman's time has expired.